This is JG the Accidental Logi san and welcome back to the review of the week guys. This time around, it's gonna be Dead Mount Dead Play Episode 13. Oh, sorry, Episode 14 pala. So, keep on watching and subscribe to this channel. I'm sure you you kind of missed this anime when, uh, when, when being reviewed. Well, we now have our chance to review it. So, let's get down to business. Face! I don't know, pero... Umpisa pa lang, tense na yung pacey. It got more. Got, got a really tense by the sequence after that. But do I have complaints? Nah. Through the pacing, through the tense pacing of this episode, malalaman nyo na na mukhang lumilit na mundo ni Polka. Overall guys, I got no complaints. Dahil, Halatang halata na na ano eh, na, well, second half of the run na, second tour na ng anime na to, and we're getting closer now to, um, to, the, to, to, that, uh, to that burning question regarding Polka. Will he ever find true peace of mind in this modern day of age without even resorting to the full extent of his powers? As the corpse god, of course. Donovan! Like in the like in the last uh, like in the last episode we reviewed, pero hindi naman na, hindi naman na review of the week. I only have one gear shift, and that was when HQ police came into Polka's unit. Well, definitely it now complicates the storyline. Kasi eto na naman tayo, right? Eto na naman. There's there's another dead body involved, and not. At, at, at uh, mukhang nakatago ito sa building na kina, pinagtataguan ni Polka. Pero, will it be enough for you to totally understand this episode? Nope. Not by a long shot. Ako na nagsasabi sa inyo. So, you'd rather watch the episode from start to finish. After all, guys, it had a really, uh, it had a really tense pacing. Which is, uh, which is typical of a, um, of a, uh, of a supernatural uh, of a supernatural anime sometimes or even an isekai and then yo dead mount dead play is an isekai but wise pero na namang flashback sequence si Paul Carito pero it just took him back to the day na uh, his, uh, his penchant of helping people uh, helping uh, of, of protecting the people closest to him parang ganun eh kasi na side Kasi na nakita na sa kanya ng, ng ganon, yung kanyang mentor. So, that went to that backstory sequence. Not an individual. Therefore, Malinis ang plot, guys! I mean, come on! Sisirain ba ng Geek Toys, okay, the studio behind this anime, ang isang napaka-tense na pacing na ganito klaseng episode? With a backstory or with a long backstory or side story or even an explainer, I do not think so, guys. All right. So, no, it's not. It's not going to. It's not going to help this episode um, uh, maintain momentum going into the next one. No. Sakto lang yung yung tense pacing eh. Wag mo na dagdagan ng ng backstory or or ng uh, ng kahit legit na backstory or side story. No, masisira eh. Masisira yung pacing. So, you only need a really clean plot to impart to the audience what is actually going on. So, pace, flow, and plot, they all came together for this episode, folks. And, well, when, comparing it to the previous one, this was way better. So, Dead Mount, Dead Play, episode 14. Yeah, no-brainer.